Before leaving the factory, the OPS module must undergo a full functionality test to ensure stable performance. Insert the OPS into a device with a standard 80-pin interface and confirm it is fully seated. After powering on, the system should boot normally without blue screens, legs, or crashes. Test HDMI and VGA outputs for clear and stable display. Check that USB ports can recognize devices like USB drives, mice, and keyboards. Verify that COM ports transmit data correctly. Ensure wired network and Wi-Fi connections are stable and audio output is free of noise. Confirm that the M to NVMe SSD is detected and has proper read or write speeds. Test operating system compatibility e.g. Windows, WOS, Kylin to ensure smooth performance. Finally, run a high load, long duration stress test to ensure there is no overheating, crashes, or unexpected restarts. Test HDMI and VGA outputs for clear and stable display. Check that USB ports can recognize devices like USB drives, mice, and keyboards. Verify that COM ports transmit data correctly. Ensure wired network and Wi-Fi connections are stable and audio output is free of noise. Confirm that the M to NVMe SSD is detected and has proper read or write speeds. Test operating system compatibility e.g. Windows, WOS, Kylin to ensure smooth performance. Finally, run a high load, long duration stress test to ensure there is no overheating, crashes, or unexpected restarts.